The Rumason fell down. The Rumason fell down. Hello everyone, Andrew of Proving Demons, and welcome back to another Proving or Debunking Urban Legends. Today I'm going to be doing the famed uh, Bloody Mary Challenge. Now, as you guys have seen, I've done a number of urban legends. Uh, gotten evidence, strong evidence for a couple of them now, actually, that they may actually be real. And I've been wanting to do Bloody Mary for quite a while now. Oh, God. How long ago was that posted? I posted this video, what, five years ago. Not bad on views, though. I mean, it got, what, 68K? Cool. Right, listen, I have not done a urban legend proving or debunking in a long time. I've just done an underground video. It's my last video, the one before that ghost hunt one before that interview with someone so i figured i'd come around full circle and try something i haven't done in a while obviously i don't really meddle around with urban legend stuff anymore so i thought maybe i'd make it a little more interesting meaning um me and kaylee are just gonna have a little celebration it is my birthday week uh i'm thinking get lit and try the bath game uh, if you guys don't know what that is it's called Darumason. i figure i'll explain it now because i don't think i'll be able to explain it very well um after this after this. So, um, Darumasan is a Japanese urban legend, and basically you play in the bathtub and you try to get a Japanese ghost to appear before you who will follow you around all throughout the next day, and the goal is not to get caught by her. So, yeah, bit irresponsible, but hey, life's all about having fun, right? We'll see you in a minute. What's up, guys? Currently 11.42 in the morning. Uh, right, sorry, it's but... not the morning. Oh. <laughs> it's not. What's up guys? Currently 11.43 in the morning and uh... It's not the morning! It's not the morning! What's up guys? Currently 11.43 at night. Why are you laughing so hard? <laughs> right, listen. Um, so I haven't had a video out in a little bit. I'm currently in the demon house of Devon doing road tripping all across the south. But I'm kind of sat here because I'm about to have to celebrate my birthday in a couple days. So I don't have much time to film at the moment. So I need a video, right? I've been on the road, I really need a bath. And um, also, I've been dying to do a ritual recently. So I figured, I'm a man with very little time. Why don't we just kill all of it in one go? Kill three birds with one stone. So tonight, we're playing the bath game. Or called uh, Darumasan. Is it Darumasan? Yeah, it's probably, I won't even Google it. It's called Darumasan. It's an urban legend. I'm gonna do it, Spoony. <laughs> 11 in the morning. <laughs> it's 11 at night. And, uh, yeah, it should be spooky. I'm gonna get all the equipment out. I think it'll be a fucking blast. Right. So you're about to take a dip. Is that right? Yeah, apparently so. Okay. So obviously you can't go in quite like that because that's gonna be a lot of washing. A lot of tumble drying. <laughs> I cannot be bothered that right now, okay? So you need a shirt, alright? No problem. There's a shirt. That's for you. Um, I only have one slight problem. You needed shorts. You didn't have any shorts. I do have some, but I don't know how you're gonna feel about them, all right? Why? Okay. <laughs> so, no. how, how do you feel about those? Not happening. My bollocks will slip out on camera. <laughs> Literally, my I feel like if you wore the boxes, you'd be fine, though. No, my, bo my balls would fall out. I'm sorry. I think, do you know what? I think you'd rock them. Look at them. Can we just get them hold up? <laughs> Look at them. Spoony, but I ain't that spoony. Uh, babe? Yeah. We got a problem. Where are you at? There you are. It says here that at night before you go to bed, take a bath. It must be before midnight. Oh, fuck. Yeah, we have oh. like seven minutes to run a bath. Stop. I'm eating dinner. All right, let's go. Okay, come on. Let's go. All right, quick. If we want to be possessed, we got to do this ASAP. Running out of time, running out of time. Light switch. All right, start running the bath immediately. Let's move this stupid girly stuff nobody cares about. <laughs> um, which one's hot? That one. Also, lights have to be oh, off. Oh, hang on, I can't fucking see. Light, <laughs> lights have to be off. <laughs> for this one. I can't see the water. All right, all right, all right, all right. There. Okay, all right. Um, oh fuck, what do we need? Oh, we need some water. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we need. Well, you didn't plug it in, is it? Oh yeah. <laughs> 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 okay, wait. Um. Oh god. What are you doing? This is so stressful. 
But soap, I don't care about soap at the moment. It's called coconut. Woo! It's not working. So, for those who didn't know, Daruma-san is a Japanese ritual game uh, called the bath game. Essentially, what I have to do is go into the bath, wash my hair, maybe it's some sort of cleansing ritual, I'm not entirely sure, and then chant some words where, if, if all goes correctly, a ghostly woman will appear near the tap. So, I'm actually going to place a K2 meter here by the tap, <laughs> which, oddly, is already going off. I haven't even started the game yet, but that's interesting. Don't forget, we are in a haunted house already, by the way, so it could be factors here. Not entirely sure, but she is supposed to appear by the tap. Mm, I'm cringing while editing this. I'm pretty sure by she appears by the tap, they meant the tap to the bathtub. For some reason last night, I thought it meant the sink faucet. Oh, it only gets worse from here, actually. Let's continue. They do say, though, that if you mess up this game, or mess about, or you don't do it correctly, you're basically haunted for life. Um, considering I... <laughs> I am already haunted for life. Um, it's a risk I'm gonna take, just to see. I used to do this all the time, really. Just found it interesting to maybe try a few more. Oh, that K2 meter is still going off right by the tap. Daruma-san! Daruma-san! Huh. Okay. While I'm at it, I might as well just do the Bloody Mary ritual. Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary, I stole your baby. Ha! <laughs> right at the moment I said it. Yeah, that still has some power, guys. If you haven't seen my old Bloody Mary video, where I prove Bloody Mary's real, go check it out. Just type in Proving Demons Bloody Mary. Anyway, how's the bath coming along? Uh, not bad. Like, Let's it have should a look. be about another three minutes. You look need at, it all the way to the top. I'm so. looking forward to it. Yeah, it should be quite nice. Right, well, as the K2 meter continues to go off, the bathtub is full and ready to go, and I'm going to hand Kaylee the camera. Thank you. Do not drop that. Shall I grab the again. flashlight? Oh my god. Well. My phone's in my pocket. <laughs> I almost just got in with my phone. Pam, pass me the flashlight. Here's the torch. So, <laughs> what do I say flashlight and you say torch? You're the American, not me. No. <laughs> oh, now I remember why I had my phone. Silly me. Because I sent you a link. And right. in that link, it told me the chant I had to say. That KG meter is going really mental. Um, okay, okay, fill the bathtub with water, turn off the lights, place yourself in the middle of the bathtub, close your eyes, start washing your hair. While you're washing your hair, say the sentence, Darumasan fell down, Darumasan fell down, that's all you gotta say. And if it all goes correctly, she will slip and fall in the bathroom on that rusty tap. And the tap is oh, somewhat God. rusty, I'm not gonna lie. Amazing, right. The Rumasan fell down. No, no, don't put your phone back in your pocket. Put it on the, put it on the um... Right. No, Is darling, it? stop putting your phone in your pocket. <laughs> Listen. Your pocket's empty. Yep. Okay. Now listen, guys. Obviously, this is a paranormal investigation. You're wondering why I'm wearing clothes in the bath. I have to dress the part while I'm ghost hunting. <laughs> Right, I'm in the bath. Oh, I'm supposed to wash my hair, aren't I? Do you want the head and shoulders? You got it? Do you want me to get it? I'm paranoid now, I have other things. <laughs> no, okay. Yeah, let me just put the flashlight between my legs. No, no, no. Oh, wait, I can't see now. Grab me the head you and shoulders. You want this? Yeah, give me some head and shoulders. All right, take that. All right. The Rumasan fell down. The Rumasan fell down. The Rumasan fell down. The Rumasan fell down. I'm washing my hair. The Rumasan fell down. The Rumasan fell down. The Rumasan fell down. The 
the Rubicon fell down. The Rubicon fell down. Uh, the KG meter is spiking, by the way, over at the. Uh... Oh, okay. It's going up to orange. I'm gonna be honest with you. Oh. Right? Yeah. Darumasan fell down. Um, this is a weird game we're playing. <laughs> okay, so do you want to do me a favor? I'm gonna continue washing. Yeah. And saying Darumasan fell down. Would you turn the spirit box on for me? Uh, yeah, I'm, just, I'm gonna put this down now, obviously. Hang on, put that there. Um, one handed? I will try my best. Can you pull the stick out? Just the tip, that's it. Yep, just a tip. That's, what it, that's my <laughs> favorite line. S box. Scanning. FM. The room of song fell down. 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 The Rubicon 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 fell down. Listen, look, look at the kid Jimmy. This is going to mess Oh, wow. I got a spike yeah, spiky massacre. The Rubicon fell down. 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 Box I'll review that, but I didn't hear anything. Um, right, should I get out and go something with you? <laughs> That's a really good idea. Do you want a towel? Right, let me just put this down. Oh, man. Can I get the light real quick? Did you drop the towel in there? <laughs> By the way, represent. <laughs> okay, so far nothing but the K2 meter has gone off. Um, I don't know about this urban legend. You know it's how many a good one, isn't it? I was gonna say, you know how many urban legends I've debunked and how many I've proven. Now, there sure as shit was not a Japanese ghost that just hit their head on the faucet like I was supposed to see. Yeah. Part of the ritual also states though that tomorrow I should keep seeing her over my shoulder. Oh, okay. So what I think I'll do tomorrow is kind of keep updates and let you all know. Yeah, sounds good. In the meantime, stop recording. Let me get out of here and then let's uh, do a proper go something real quick. No problem. Well, <laughs> I got what I asked for. I don't. I'm sat here wondering now. Why did I even bother wearing socks? I honestly have no idea. <laughs> I'm so. <laughs> Uh, right, um, I'm gonna have to dry my hands to use any more ghost hunting equipment. So now that we've done the ritual, the ritual's over. K2 meters still going mental. Show them, show them. Oh, not bad. Yeah. Right, um, I'm going to get back into my pajamas and uh, we shall do some EVPs up in here. See if this urban legend is proved or debunked. Do you guys remember that? You remember that? Like three or four, five years, oh god, that was like five years ago. Five years ago where I used to prove and debunk urban legends. Here you go, I'm doing it for you right now. You're welcome. Oh, the K2's going off. Oh, oh do you like that? <laughs> you naughty little girl, aren't you? Is it a girl ghost, actually? It's a she girl ghost, yeah, she likes it. Do you like that? Right, give me that. <laughs> Will that thing ever stop flashing? It's very odd. I, I will admit, I don't know why it's flashing there. I highly doubt that there is a cable. 
uh, or internet line or anything running behind there, but we'll do a quick EVP. Remember, uh, the last ghost hunt we did, it was like the church cleansed us in this, so I'm going to see if the voice comes through again, if we get something completely different, or if it works perfectly fine. Well, first and foremost, the bars are moving like mental. Hello? Darumasan? Or is this the monster? The, the demon? Who are you? Talk to me. I don't know. My voice is so plain. I didn't know about my voice this time. Yeah. Nothing. So only at the beginning, but everything else played normally. It's so weird. The last word I hear is, it's impossible. It's impossible. Mm. That's what I hear at the very end. That's odd. Let me try one more. Darumasan, Darumasan, Darumasan. Who is it speaking to us? Nothing. Oh, absolutely so strange, nothing. Isn't it? We got something in the first bit, but absolutely nothing. Yeah. Cage meter still spiking. Yeah. I mean, the only other thing I can think to do. Hold on, just for shits and giggles. We're getting something through here from something. We're getting some K2 spikes. Just because we can. Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary, I stole your baby. Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary, I stole your baby. One quick Bloody Mary ritual. Who was saying that? There's a weird breath there. Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary, I stole your baby. Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary, I stole your baby. Nothing. Which holds credence to the fact that we had the, it sounded like the monster's voice coming through when we first started. Yeah. But then it didn't come back. Unlike recently when it's been happening non-stop. Last try. Hello? Who's here? Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary, I stole your baby. Nothing. 
Right. My hypothesis. Personally, I have not done a proving or debunking an urban legend in a very long time. So I thought it would be quite fun to do it. The last one I did was the Red Book Ritual, but to be fair, the Red Book Ritual actually has a place in history, while most of these urban legends have places as like high school folklore. Um, but I used to, many years ago, prove or debunk their existence. And tonight we did Darumasan. I've never done it before. I gave it a go. I did take it seriously, but also had a bit of a laugh while doing it. And I can say that I have not garnered any actual paranormal activity from it. I mean, granted, yes, okay. We can look at the K2 meter spiking by the sink. Don't know why, but it is. But that doesn't prove anything, you know? It could just be spiking. I mean, okay, let me, let me just... It's still going off over here. Yeah. So it's not just the sink. Spirit box, as far as I'm aware at this point, because I've not reviewed, no results. Mm -hmm. Digital recorder, that was just the entity that already follows me anyway. With that being said, I will keep you posted by the end of tomorrow, as in I will go about my day tomorrow, see how it goes. If I notice anything or supposedly see her behind my back, I'll let you know. But real talk, I do believe that this ritual probably doesn't have much legitimacy behind it. Still, it was fun to do, though. Anyway, I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Good night. Well, that was an interesting night, to say the least. Woke up, my clothes are soaked in the bathtub. But overall, I've not had any real paranormal activity happen today. I've been looking over my shoulder. I've not seen Daruma Sun. I've not seen any lady who hit her head on the faucet. Nothing. No paranormal activity. So just like my old urban legend debunkings, I'm going to go ahead and debunk this one for now. Until I have further evidence in the future. But just to play it safe, you, to end the ritual, you're supposed to say the words kita, which means cut in Japanese, while making the motion with your hand. So why don't we go ahead and do that now and end the ritual. Daruma Sun! Thank you for not appearing today, I guess. I would have liked to see you and maybe believe that there was something to this. But, to be safe, Kicha! Now, that being said, right? If you enjoyed this video, you probably didn't. But to be honest with you, my last two videos have been absolute bangers this month. I haven't had much time to go out and film this week because I've been traveling and it is also my birthday. Literally, I believe this video is going out on my birthday. So wish me happy birthday down below. But if you did enjoy this, I do have a playlist of urban legend proving and debunking from back in the day. And they are actually quite good. I have proven some of them. Um, and on that note, speaking of some banging videos I've done, click this link right here. It's an absolute banger of a video. Don't even think about it. Just click it. And we'll end it as we always do. Do you believe yet? Yeah.